Hello friends, subscribe technology and press the bell icon to never miss the updates. Hey guys, welcome back to our channel Technology. So in this video, I'm going to show you guys how to assign multiple IP in one LAN card, any Windows 10 computer. You can also apply this method on Windows 7 or Windows 8.1 computer. So you just need to follow me and don't forget to subscribe our channel Technology for more videos like these. So without wasting any more time, let's start the video. So first of all, you need to open a run box on your computer. So for that, you need to press Windows and R button together from your keyboard. Just press windows and r button together after that you will get this run dialog box on your computer so you have to type over there ncpa.cpl to open the network connection you can as you can see here is my main lan card and this too is my vmware virtual lan card so i, I am going to assign two ip address on my main lan card which is uh, ethernet tricks motion this one so what i have to do i need to put one by one all the IP address suppose I need to put uh, this two range of IP like 172.0.1 range of IP and 192.168.0.1 range of IP so what I have to do I need to just uh, right click on my Ethernet and just go to your properties and after that uh, double click on this Internet Protocol version 4 or you can click on these properties directly select that Internet version 4 and click on properties and now you have to assign use this option is called use the following IP address that means static IP address you have to put over there so first of all I need to type this is IP like 192.168.0.1 so I'm going to put this IP over there 0 0.4 because my one is my gateway so I'm going to put 104 IP address now I have to put the default gateway okay and after that I have to put the DNS so you can also put multi, multiple DNS address over there that I will show you later so now you have to click on advanced option and after that if you want to add more IP address over there then just simply click on this add option and after that you have to put this uh, second range of IP over there like 172.18.0.1 and after that press tab then you can see the subdate marks is automatically assigned over there after that click on add and for gateway you have to click on add over there on this option and after that you have to put the gateway you can put any gateway with it over there after that if you want to uh, assign a more dns address on your LAN card then you have to click on this dns tab and after that you have to put over there uh, more dns like 10.10.10.1 .10 .10 okay so it's done after done you have to click on ok and after that click on ok and we close so i hope this small video will really help for you and please don't forget to click on the subscribe button like button and share button and if you have any queries or question then comments below i will see you guys in the next one next video take care